the 9-9, when people are still backing that ass up to juvenile, the Browns have had 30 different quarterbacks start the game. Names like Tim Couch, who's on a couch, Johnny Manziel, who's almost on a couch. He's on a Canadian couch. couch. Yeah. <laughs> Eating Canadian bacon. <laughs> then you got Jeff Garcia, who may be on a sofa. And Charlie Fry, who's probably frying fries somewhere right now. Now it's time for good old shake and bake in Cleveland. Well, is he going to really make it shake? Or should we focus on the bake? Well, I think <laughs> <laughs> that was an incredible Bake. intro. Bake like, I don't, I don't even know Bake. where I should take it there. Uh, so Baker Mayfield, is, the, listen, the Raiders don't really have much at a safety at the safety position. So I think Njoku is going to have a good game here. Oh. I also think Carlos Hyde, you and I talked offline about Carlos Hyde. Like yeah. last week, two touchdowns, over 100 yards, that powerful. He scored every week. And let's not forget, Hugh Jackson was a running backs coach, so he likes to run the ball. Yeah. A little bit of a revenge narrative him for him here coming back to Oakland. But I think what Baker Mayfield does is he opens up this whole offense. And you saw that in the way not just the whole team played, but the way that Carlos Hyde looked like vintage, powerful, giddy up was back. I really like it. I like him the most in this offense from a consistency standpoint. But you're the running back, so you tell me. Yeah, no, he's good. He's a good player. Shout out to him. He just had his first baby. Yeah. He got his first win as a Brown. Shout out to the baby. Uh, <laughs> no, nah, but seriously, I think he's good. And, and Mayfield is going to open up the playbook, like you said. And when you can't, when you can't peel your ears back, and focus on one particular part of the offense, you got to account for all 11 players, like, it, it, it changes the game massively. So I think, um, you know, the Browns got a lot to be excited for, for, for once in a long time. Now, again, it's not a shot to Tyrod, because I like him. I really do uh, a lot. It's just that we knew at some point Mayfield was going to be the guy, and he has swag, and he has leadership capability, and the stadium is. I'm excited is to see him on the road in the yep. black hole up against Gruden and and that be, you know and that that depleted defense in, in Oakland. So I think it's an opportunity for him to light and it up. The best thing about this, he has nothing to lose and a lot of things to make. So let's talk about making a movie. Yeah, let's talk about making a movie. A lot of plays to movie. make is okay. what I meant to say. I'm still working on my teleprompter skills, but shit, I'm getting there. Oh. Switch seats with you, oh, okay. Right? <laughs> okay, you get on inside. All right, so what's weird. the game? After Fantasy Lit, we always do some Oh, yeah, type of so games. after so Fantasy Lit, today? so right now we're going to wrap up this, wrap this up with a little fantasy Hollywood style. Ooh. Okay. So which actor plays you in the mostly football future film? Well, in the most. Ben, you better not say Brad Pitt. <laughs> nah, nah. Because nah. we know that Brad Pitt is a lot more handsome than you. I mean, have you seen Snatch? <laughs> like, you know, I, I'm not that Brad Pitt. I'm going to go with a guy who actually went to college with Liz. Uh, his name's John Krasinski from The Office. Oh. Um, nice. Here's why. Oftentimes, people come up to me and say, hey, you were great on The Office. I say, I was not on that show. Also, he has a super hot wife. So do I. Shout out to my wife, Mariah. Oh. His wife, if you want. And, uh, I, and he was in Leatherheads, too, which is the closest he'll ever get to playing professional yeah. football, and that, but, that would be the closest I'll I have another gets. one, but first you can't compliment another man's wife by complimenting your wife. We both got but hot eyes. We both the same character somebody, in the mostly football movie. I have somebody else in mind for you. <laughs> Who you got? Ooh. Can we bring it up? Who you got for me? This should be good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Martellus. Story, story. If I had a dollar for every time somebody said I look like Woody from Toy Story, I'd have <laughs> enough money to buy a collared shirt. I'll, say that. <laughs> so, I'll take Woody. What about you, Liz? Um, well, I think mine's, I think it's pretty solid. I'd like to see you poke holes into it. But petite, kind of nerdy, very smart, a pistol, Anna Kendrick. Oh, I love her. her. I love Anna yeah. Kendrick. Can yeah, you sure. rap like Anna Kendrick? Can you spit yeah. bars like Anna Kendrick? No, sure can. Yeah, sure can. <laughs> I, I, I don't know how to play those cups the way. <laughs> I'll just like Cooper Cup. What about you, Rashad? If I could have anybody play myself in a movie, uh, Michael B. J. Michael B. J. Jordan. Who is that? No, Hold up. <laughs> Michael B. Michael B. Jordan. <laughs> That's his cousin. Yeah. <laughs> Even if it's a Chatsworth. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of movie is he's this? Still, he's still in Fruitville Station. <laughs> Michael B. Jordan. I'm trying to get out. <laughs> get out part two. <laughs> How about Martellus? Who plays Martellus in the mostly football movie? Samuel Jackson, of course. Like, <laughs> god damn. Like, motherfucker this, motherfucker that, and motherfuckers on this motherfucker. Play. What does Marcellus look like? Does Marcellus look like a bitch? I, well, yeah, I need a you. Good one. What I need you to do? <laughs> I need you to reach in that bag and get the wallet that says "bad, badass motherfucker." Which one is it? The one that says "badass motherfucker." Samuel Jackson all the way. Plethora of movies, consistent, hardworking, talented, and we kind of look alike, except from a lot more ha uh, handsome. So, 
Yeah, woman? Woman? No, I thought you was eyes. Woman? Oh, you get in with the woman? Sam Jackson eyes. Where's my super suit? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to see the Mostly Football movie coming soon. Liz, thank you so much for That's rocking hilarious. out with us, as always, getting us ready for fantasy this weekend.